How's it going, everyone? On Osites back here. Another video. We're uh, on episode three of Chosen's Modded Adventure, and uh, I might sound a little different this this uh, episode because I've I've tweaked my mic a little bit to hopefully make it sound better. Yeah, you guys can just let me know in the comments if I do sound any better. But I feel like this one's a little more smooth. But yeah, we uh we got some we got some stuff to do uh this episode, and unfortunately, I think we're gonna be we're gonna be abandoning our starter base and we're gonna get rid of this guy real quick he about took out the base for us but yeah i was actually watching chosen's uh series and it definitely i don't think it was meant to be a tutorial but it definitely helped me out on what i need to be doing i got some i got some things we're gonna be crafting this episode so yeah let's just go ahead and grab we're going to go ahead and grab our important things, maybe. All of our ores and stuff like that. And we're going to go find a new place to set up shop. Yeah, we're pretty much just uh, going to start fresh here. Go find a new spot. We might we might revisit this place down the road. Uh, sleeping bag. Take with us. We're going to get into the, the Ars Nova uh, mod as much as we can, too. It looks really fun with the... With the magic and spells and stuff. We're going to try our best to get into that. Because, man, that last episode, I was just so confused on what to do. Where to go. I definitely learned a lot about his, uh, the basics of this, this mod pack. Watching his first couple episodes. But, yeah, let's, uh, let's go find us a new spot. It's pretty neat. This is a nice spot. It's a really nice spot. But we're going to keep looking. I wouldn't mind finding like a pre-built structure just to kind of start. We've learned about these towers now too. Just take the TNT out of them. And we don't die no more to TNT. I'm pretty sure that's all we have to do. Trident? Soulbound. Looting. Multi-shot. Take the gold. Break it. I wonder what's going on down there. All right, let's keep looking. Found some mycelium. Wait, we should be able to uh, make a, a crafting table on a stick. There we go. Put it in our slot. There we go. Now we can use the crafting table on a stick. We'll just boop, throw that right out. We don't even need that no more. Never have to place another crafting table again. What do we have here? Hot, hot air balloon? More bread? Gold nuggets. Nice. Oh, what is that? Bamboo creeper. Uh, these guys are... These guys are really blending in, huh? Not sure why they didn't explode. Something else out here. A little well out in the water. I do like the eucalyptus trees. Looks cool. Got a windmill? Ooh, it's Turtle Island. Sub little turtles. They're scared of me. Oh yeah, I also also figured out we can bang mine. I did not know that. I'm really glad we can do that now too. It's gonna be a fresh start. Our title in this video is a fresh start. We're finding somewhere to go and we're gonna live there. Trumpet log? I don't think we need no trumpet logs right now. There's a specific tree we're looking for too. The arc wood or something like that. It has, it has something to do with the with the Ars Nova mod. Something to do with the spells. It's like a it's like a large purple tree. I think I came across one in the beginning of this series, but I didn't realize it was gonna be important. Okay, we got a little little village down here with some horses. Oh, I didn't bring my saddle. Horse would have been kinda nice. Oh, they drop leather, don't they? Whoa. Alright, we ended up getting the the leather. I'm not sure where the horses went, but there's two wings. And I think there's the frame. Is this how it goes? Yes it is. There we go. We got our got our hang glider. Now we should be able to get around a little better. There we go, that's a full that's a full set. 
armor. Came across the dungeon, it looks like, down in here. Let me eat before we go down in here. Might be some spawners or something. Oh, yeah. Let's see if we can clear this out. set our sleep back down before we explore this any farther. I think that says my spawn. Hopefully. Not sure what's going to be in here, but... Oh, here we go. There's a spawner. Get rid of that. Go see what this got out. Miner guide. Oh yeah, that's pretty useful. All of our pockets, right? There we go. Should upgrade the efficiency on of our on our tools now. But there's a lot of entrances here we can go down in, so see what we find. Bond right there. Ooh. Oh, they're spawning right there. They must be oh, they're spawning. It's another chest. Okay. Diamond shovel, smithing template. Nice. It's a better chest we found. Cleared this room pretty much. Oh. Baby zombie on a chicken? We did loot this way already. There must be another spawner somewhere. Maybe in here. No. That's alright, let's go back up on this side. Go down this way. Here we go. Yeah, my PvP skills ain't the best. I got this gravity gravity uh, thing on my chest plate. It's kind of hard to crit them. Oh, this one is. This dude's strong right here. There we go. What's this stuff? Crimsite? Oh, I need to heal up. Some more books, fire aspect, flame. Oh, this is part of the create mod, okay. So we just get out of here. I don't think we're missing anything too important. Got us a diamond shovel out of it. I believe we got some more iron. We can upgrade this backpack real quick. We're gonna do that before we do anything. Let's just get rid of the let's get rid of the cobblestone. What's that? Oh my god. I don't know what that was. Oh, it's this dude. Get away from this guy. I wonder if we're able to I wonder if we're able to kill this thing. A blitz? And if I had a bow, I got the boomerang. Oh, it brought him back. Okay. I'll play. Come on, one more hit. Oh, get wrecked, dude. You kidding me? There we go. Grab our sleeping bag and we go find, find where we're going to set up base again. Finally getting some stuff done. Oh my God, look at it. We got giraffes. And lions? These dudes are probably aggressive, I'm guessing. Maybe not. 
All right, we got to keep an eye out for that purple tree as well. Oh, there's so much jungle on this seed. More that way. Is this our tree? No, but this is something, right? It's the first time I've seen that tree. Like some sort of jungle village. I'll be taking this from you. I'm going to need a little bit more iron. Here we go. More bread. See you later. Looks like there's some more buildings up here. Hopefully some more iron. And there's some more iron. Oh, yeah, we should be able to... Oh, we can vein mine that. Okay. Nice. Two iron picks. Iron shovel. 28% efficiency. I believe that one's better than the one I have now, too. It is. Good. I have a, I have a pretty decent sized map back now. Just throw everything in there. Good little adventure so far. I'm getting a little bit of loot. Artisan relic? That seems maybe important. And we're leaving the jungle. We're trying to find a spot to live still. Oh, here's our here's our wood right here south. There it is. Found the wood we were after. Bastion fruit. Should be able to vein mine this. Yeah. There we go. Grab we got this glider. Let's try it out. Oh my god. Oh, yeah, that's awesome. Very useful. On the bee farm, we got some moo blooms. We got a villager, a beekeeper. Oh, let's keep going south and see. That's cool though. We, it's a, that's an option. What is this? Is that a starbuncle? Starbuncle fields? Oh my god, that's awesome. <laughs> it's got a chunk of gold on top of it. Oh yeah, look at all the starbuncles. Oh my. I don't know if anything's in that or not, but I don't really want to destroy it either. More of that wood, cascading arc wood. Okay, I think I think we're gonna need this too. Glider just saved my life. See how far we can get here. Oh. It's an Enderman, ain't it? Mushroom Fields, Enderman. We've been running for a while now, so hopefully we come across a little pre-built structure we can work off of. Alright, everyone, so I think we've made up our mind. Maybe not. That's burning down. It's a little bit of a disaster going on over there. There's a cave I came across. Huge cave. And... We actually might have something right here we can build around. Oh yeah, this is perfect. This is us right here. After all that running, we finally found a spot to stay. I'll go ahead and just clear all this out. Place some storage. This should be perfect. Let's get rid of these. All this grass. And I kind of want to make a floor though, so maybe we'll uh, we need to use some sort of block. We got a bunch of this cascading arc wood. Maybe we'll use that for our for our floor. Might even turn it into slabs. Yeah, let's do that. I'm gonna tear out a lot of this. The vein mine is so useful. Now we're just gonna fill this in. All right, this is our fresh start right here. I just wanna get a little platform down. We can start getting some some storage set down. Might have to make some more slabs. Not a big fan of the shield, actually. I'm gonna go ahead and just take that off. We should have enough slabs to finish this. Even if we have to make some more. Well, at least fill all these gaps. The vein miner kind of went crazy right there. There we go. 
I gave us a little, little foundation to work off of. Fill in a few more. No big deal. All right, there we go. We're gonna try making some crates, which I've seen are very useful. But we need just some, just oak logs. Do that, do that. There we go, that's one crate. Should be able to make one more. That should be enough now. Just go ahead and throw one here. Throw another one there. That's a pretty fresh start if I've ever seen one. We're gonna sleep again and we're gonna craft a few things. Scribing table right here. Which is the arc wood was that we have. We should be able to make that. Three slabs, two logs. There we go, scribes table. Um, oh, I don't want to put it sideways. <laughs> I'll break this real quick. Oh, can I just pick it up? No? Okay, I gotta break it. I do want to set it here though. There we go, that's perfect. Now, should be able to make our spell book. So we need all of our tools. Yeah, let's go ahead and do that. We need sword, shovel. Okay, sword and shovel. There we go. And then we should just need a book. We're definitely going to want to get into some magic. Put our book. I don't think it matters what order, does it? It might. No, I don't. Okay, perfect. It's so actually what Chosen did on his. He did the... I believe he does the projectile and the break, and he named it the break spell, which is very, very useful. Yeah, we should, okay. We pretty much can break any block or even uh, attack mobs with it. But we're going to have to get our mana up eventually. It is a projectile. We'll be able to upgrade this as soon as we get all that. Now that we got the scribe table, I'm trying to figure out how to open this. Oh, we gotta hit it with our book. Okay. We can uh, craft these glyphs and then they'll go into our spell book, is what we're trying to do here. Oh, we're gonna get a lantern and a torch. Oh, we had we had 12 torches. Whoops. For some reason, these, these aren't wanting to stack. Now we should be able to make that glyph now. I think. Select. Crafting. Okay, yeah, there it is. It's doing its thing. Conjure light, I believe we can get night vision when we go caving, because we're gonna have to go caving for some more some more resources. Oh, uh toss remaining items under the table. Oh, whoops. There we go. Now it's making the glyph and we should be able to grab this. And right click. Unlock conjure mage light and then whoops. I didn't mean to break my floor there. Open this. We should be able to make a new should be able to make a new spell, I believe. One through ten. We can just we can switch through them. This is our break spell. It's our break spell. Let's make this one our make this one our night vision. Night vision. So if we do self and mage light. Now we have night vision, so when we go caving. All right, everybody. So we found our we found our fresh start. Our starter base is thirty six hundred meters away from where we are. So we'll go ahead and make a new waypoint here. New starter base. Fresh start. Boom! Right there. Then uh, yeah, we figured out our Arsenal Bay mod. We figured out. How to make a couple crates, which Chosen, I watched his first couple episodes, and he pretty much has all the things to get started in this mod pack. I know it's heavily focused on the Arsene of A mod and the Create mod, so we're going to focus on doing that. I finally figured out, finally figured out what we have to do in this, in this, uh, in this mod pack, so I'm glad we could do that. But yeah, we'll explore some caves in the next episode, and yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. If you did, uh, like and subscribe, and turn on your notifications where we can continue this series, and let me know what you guys think. Thanks for watching.